Well, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Rainbow Investing, alternative investing strategies where we look at a broad spectrum of ideas and interesting ways to increase your long-term wealth. Now, today we're going to be talking about the dip. That's right, the dip. Stocks to buy in this fantastic opportunity. Now, um, I'm not someone who tries to time the market. Anyone who does, um, frankly, is, doesn't really know what they're doing. Um, but I can tell you that the, the events of last week, and perhaps this week, we're not sure yet, um, provide a, a, a fantastic opportunity um, to get into some of those stocks you've been watching. And I'm gonna share to you today with some of the stocks I've been watching that I think might be really worth looking at. Now, the first stock we're gonna look at is Facebook, ticker symbol FB. Now, Facebook is traded on the NASDAQ, on the New York Stock Exchange. Um, and it, it, prior to, I think it was about February, it was trading at around $200, something like that. Um, since that time, um, it's, you know, we've had the, the Cambridge Analytica scandal. I think it, it sort of dr it dropped like a stone and then sort of worked its way up in, in quite quickly, actually. Um, but since then, it's sort of been on a downward, downward trend. Um, about two weeks ago, Facebook was trading at about $168. $168, guys. Um, now, if we look at Facebook price as of, I think, Thursday, it was about $151. Um, let me just check that decimal point there. $151.38. Now, you can see the difference here. Now, I've been looking at Facebook for a while, and I decided that it was finally at a good price to buy. Um, I bought some Facebook shares this week. It was about $157 I bought in, so I'm pretty happy with that. We'll see where it goes next week. If it, if it drops a lot further, I might be looking at uh, getting, a, getting a bigger hold in that stock because I think it's one for the future, really. Um, if you look at Facebook's future business models, you know the stuff they're doing with Instagram, the stuff they're doing with Oculus, their VR technology, I think it's really promising. This is short-term stuff, guys. Nothing about Facebook's business model has changed. Okay, that's what we're looking at. Um, I'm a long-term investor. I like to um, buy shares with an outlook over the next five years at least. And I think Facebook is a really exciting stock. And I think that this dip has given us a fantastic opportunity to get in there, which um, I have done. And um, I think if the price falls any lower, then um, I'm, I might, as I said before, I might be looking at getting into some more. All right, guys, the second stock I want to talk today about today is Alibaba, ticker symbol Baba, B-A-B-A. -B -A. Now, I think this is also a really exciting stock. For you, those of you who don't know, Alibaba is um, a Chinese company. Um, a lot of people call them the Amazon of China, but I, I actually, um, I think their business model is more akin to eBay. Um, but they are, they're getting into so much more other stuff, guys. Alibaba is not just, um, not just about that online uh, e-commerce model. They are um, looking at expanding into other Asian countries, such as India. Um, they have a huge business in cloud computing, which I think is really exciting and a really um, promising thing for the future. Um, but their stock has been hurt um, very badly by this whole US-China trade war deal. Since then, their stock price is, um, has been on a slow decline. Um, about two weeks ago, Alibaba was trading at $166. $166. If we looked at their stock price late last week, it was trading at $138. As you can see, this is another another big fall, um, and I think I, I think it is another strong buy opportunity. This is a stock that's just I believe anyway. I think it's headed for the moon. You know, China is such a huge economy. Um, they're going to grow into the future, and Alibaba is in a fantastic position to benefit from that. So um, another one to watch on the dip. Um, and my, as, uh, as with Facebook, it might go down even more next week, but that just means that um, the price that, we should, that we're getting for it is even better value. So that's another one. Now the third stock I want to look at today is an interesting one, that's for sure, and it is Tesla, ticker symbol T-S-L-A, traded on the NASDAQ. So actually, all three of these stocks are traded on the NASDAQ, so there you go, there's my bias. Now, um, Tesla is a bit of a more of an interesting one. As you guys might have heard, it is an extremely volatile stock, thanks in thanks to most part to its um, 
wonderful CEO, Mr. Elon Musk. Um, now, now, this stock has been on a bumpy ride in the night last few months, that's for sure. We had the uh, whole going private saga where Elon tweeted that um, Tesla shares, we, Tesla as a company was going private at $420 a share. Um, and of course, um, Musk got sued by the SEC for that. Um, so ever, as you can imagine, their stock price has been on a roller coaster. But I still think that this might be a good opportunity to look into some Tesla stock. Now, um, about two weeks ago, Tesla was trading at about $310. Um, which is, is around its current long-term trend, really. I think they hit a high of about $380 just before that... Um, that uh, going private saga happened. Um, if we look at its share price um, in the last, on, yeah, I think it was about Thursday, it was about $250 per share. That was uh, what it's bottomed out at this week. This is a stock I like to see as more of a speculative play because as of yet, Tesla is not a profitable company. Um, I believe they have great promise for the future. I've seen their cars, I've, um, seen reviews of their cars, the Tesla Model 3, the newest model, is actually the highest selling mid-sized luxury car in America, in the USA, that is huge. Um, most people think that they are um, on the verge of becoming profitable, but I would still call them a very speculative stock at this stage. But if you are interested in Tesla, I believe that this dip that we've just had is a fantastic opportunity to scoop up some shares, because as we know, they have um, they have hit highs of $380 before, and I believe that anyway, that Tesla is only going up. The trend towards electric vehicles is huge, um, and it's, I think they have a huge part to play in the world over the next few decades. All right, guys, that's it from me. Tell me what you think about these three stocks. Um, I think they're great opportunities. I want to know if you guys have maybe bought some. Um, I've certainly got in here. Um, not with Tesla, but with Facebook, and I'm certainly watching the other two over the next week to see where they go. Um, I'm looking forward to hearing what you guys have to say. Um, I'll be back soon with another video, uh, looking at other interesting ways to invest, but for now, good night.